whoa, whoa, why is he in here with the camera on? Because it's um, it's dark in my office and I didn't and I didn't want to be in the dark making this video. I'm scared of the dark. But anyway, Mr. Kendrick Lamar, aka Kung Fu Kenny, aka Duckworth. He just won the Pulitzer Prize, everybody. The music prize, apparently. I didn't even know they gave a music prize. But yes, they gave the dude a music prize for Dingham. And uh, yeah, a lot of people are freaking out about it. And and with, with reason, with reason. Uh, although, you know, there are a lot of younger people who don't really know what the Pulitzer Prize is and don't care. But uh, believe me, it's a high honor. But the thing is here, these older institutions, these dinosaur institutions that are slowly growing more and more culturally irrelevant are starting to get hip to the fact that this new generation, they're, they're making good shit. They're making good shit. Not all of the millennial generation's music is bad. Every generation has bad music. I mean, maybe it seems like there's a little bit more than usual because the internet makes it really easy to put up and release and access terrible music. But in my opinion, uh, there's also a lot of great stuff floating around and you just gotta look for it. And it's just now that these places are discovering this and they're finding this out and they're giving these artists the credit and the attention that they deserve. We're seeing it here. We're seeing it with the Grammys. And listen, this is a huge paradigm shift. I think it's unquestionable at this point that when people ask, hey, who are we gonna be looking back on 10 to 20 years from now is like, that, that was a classic artist, that was a great artist. It's gonna be Kendrick Lamar. Sure, there are gonna be other artists as well of this decade, but Kendrick is unquestionably going to be one of them because he makes incredible music. He makes special music. He makes unique music. He's doing things that other artists are not doing. He's doing things that some artists don't even have the talent to try to even attempt. And artists that are somewhat talented are trying to rip him off in any way that they possibly can, uh, just so that they could seem deeper than they actually are. Now, some people, of course, are gonna say, oh, Anthony, they gave it to Dam. Does that mean your opinion on Dam is wrong or blah, 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 blah? Uh, to me, this prize signifies the Pulitzer, and, and again, all these older institutions finally coming to the realization that Kendrick is de deserving of the attention that he gets. The Grammys just realized it. This place is just realizing it. And another thing that, that the Pulitzer is just realizing, and again, this is, this is why this is such a watershed moment. We're, we're reaching a point where hip-hop is not just a youth genre, it's not just a, a street genre, it's not just an underground genre, it's not even really an insular culture anymore, it's reached the point of mainstream saturation and now it's kind of being perceived as and accepted as high art. And that's, that's really kind of an honor that the genre truly hasn't received before. I mean, literally, this is the first time the music prize from this institution has been given to a rapper or a rap record. So again, I, th I think that's a big paradigm shift. That's a huge paradigm shift. I mean, it may not seem like it right now, uh, but the thing is like hip hop, even though it's, it's one of the newer popular music genres out there, it's getting to the point where it is starting to get old. And eventually hip hop is going to become like a, you know, like a kind of a classic, a classic, like a classic rockish type genre. You know what I mean? Uh, maybe one day, uh, 25 years from now, we'll see kids saying, oh, you listen to dad rap like Kendrick Lamar? You listen to dad rap? That's rap for dads. That's the rap my dad says all the time is really good. Um, it's going to happen. Everything ages and everything becomes irrelevant. But uh, even though in a way this prize is, is slightly a mark of that, it's also a sign of very good things. You know, it's a sign of, of openness and understanding and acceptance toward this genre of music that has been making, has been breaking artistic ground for a very long time. Um, and, uh, and it's great to finally see institutions uh, realizing that and giving the genre the credit it deserves for being as cutting edge and being as, uh, um, being so bold as to stare risk in the face artistically as it is. Now, is Damn the deepest record that Kendrick Lamar has come out with lyrically? Is it the most conceptual or thematic? No, absolutely not. Not by a long shot. But again, I feel like this prize isn't so much about Damn, but it's just an acknowledgement that Kendrick is just that artist right now. He is that artist within the genre 
who is just commercially successful, and he's also challenging things on a deep and an interesting artistic level. Um, and it's great to sort of see that acknowledged. And, and hopefully, and, and this is where I think that maybe a change will come as a result of this, uh, hopefully more artists and more people sort of see that. You know, they see that there is an opportunity to really kind of perform in this genre at a higher level and actually actually get something out of it. You know, it doesn't need to be like a microwaved song. It doesn't need to be like, you know, another track that sounds like The Race or another track that sounds like Bodak Yellow or another track that sounds like uh, Amigo song. You know, you can do it while conveying something significant and substantial and important to the audience. So uh, yeah, those are, those are my thoughts. Pretty exciting. It's exciting. It's an exciting time. It's an exciting thing. Uh, I hope uh, you guys are, are happy about this as I am. And uh, let me know down in the comments what you thought uh, of this news when you read it. And uh, that's it. You're the best. Anthony Fantano, Kendrick Lamar, damn Pulitzer Prize forever.